Let's get right to it. In the real world, we don't use Kaggle to make hiring decisions. Well, why not? Kaggle is not representative of real world problems. Let's say you're getting ready for a Kaggle competition. You've downloaded your nicely prepared CSV file from their site. Guess what? You've just bypassed the most difficult part of the machine learning process. Sourcing data is by far the most challenging and time consuming part of machine learning. Here's another reason. Most of the results on Kaggle aren't accurate. People have manipulated their data to achieve a top result. Have you seen competitions where the models are 100% accurate? If you know anything about machine learning, you know there's no such thing. That means they're cheating. Let's continue why we don't use Kaggle to make hiring decisions. People copy their notebooks from other people. It's not their own work. If you scored in the top 1% on Kaggle competitions, could you show me and walk me through your notebook? Then we might have something. Most can't do this. If you could, you would know that all the top models had features that were engineered and could explain what that is and how you did it. Again, not something most people could do or even know. Another reason why Kaggle isn't used in the real world is model democratization. When the founder of Kaggle was asked recently, why aren't there more structured data competitions? He responded with, because we know the best model for those problems. But what does that mean? He means that 80% of all real-world machine learning is regression and classification on structured data, and the top model for that problem are gradient boosters. That means we don't have to have competitions if we know who the winner is going to be every time. One last thing. Modeling is completely automated for this type of problem. If I want the best performing gradient booster for my problem, I simply upload my Quince data set to AutoML tables, and I have the best model anyone can create. We don't put any value in Kaggle in the real world. Kaggle is for playtime, it's not for prime time. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And of course, have a great day. We'll see you soon.